let me share with you another convey strategy. And this is one that is uh, sometimes is talked about as the Popeye plan. Have you heard of the Popeye plan? Absolutely. Yeah. Help walk us through this because this is phenomenal. So, uh, and I'm not going to go into the, the, uh, the, the gory details, but let's say that you want to, uh, you've got a key uh, family member, a key executive, someone that you want to convey value to, and you're not in an LLC, taxes a partnership, you can't use profits interest. So what you do is you seed, S-E-E-D, a small amount of capital, a small amount of capital so that you can, you can have a, this key executive have some ownership. Let's presume that the founder has 99 shares and now you seed 1%. So now it's 99 and one. Okay. That's the capital structure. Using this redemption strategy, let's say the company now redeems 90 shares from the founder. The new share table is nine and one. First question, Michael, what is now, what percentage of the company does the founder now own? Founder owns 90%. 90%. Very good. Some people say that 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 he sold off 90% of the business because he went from 99 to to 9. Right. But it's the it's the shares that are left because the company re redeemed them. So now you have nine shares plus the one. So now what percentage of the company does the executive now own? It's now the executive owns 10%. So how much tax did that executive pay in order to go up? from 1% to 10%. Zero. Bubkiss. <laughs> wow. That's phenomenal. And you can use this technique as long as it's no more than 20% shifting of value uh, per year. And you can use this to go from 99 to, to, to 80 to, to, you know, uh, 20% of 80 is 16. So you can bring it down to 64. So you can do that year over year to really shift the balance of power. And that all goes back to the whole concept of prospect theory. Why would I do this? I would do this if you want to flip the ownership and use the a key thing here is, is that you're using the triple A account, the accumulated adjustments account. I think I'm getting, I know I'm getting geeky here. So excuse me for doing that, but using the, the um, AAA account as redemption capital, not distribution capital. Got it, it works off of 301 and 302 of the tax code, but those are redemption strategies. So profit centrist is a redemption strategy. The um, redeem and accrete is a, is a redemption strategy, sometimes called the Popeye plan. Okay. But just learning sell, pay, and convey, and how you can use all these different techniques is something that our team does all in the context of, of, of the broader arc of right. the business owner experience.